My name is Bonifac Litai, and I am dealing with Leon Burger Dogs. I have always liked big sized dogs, and I always looked at Leon Burgers as the dog, with capital letters. This breed otherwise was originated from Germany, where there is a city, called Leonburg. The coat of arms of Leonburg contains a lion and Heinrich Essig, the advisor and entrepreneur of Leonburg, found out that he wants a dog breed to be formulated, which is similar to a lion by the outlook. In the 1930s he crossed a black and white Newfoundlander dog with a St. Bernard male and later some of the puppies were crossed with Great Pyrenees dogs. The result of this crossbreeding were long-haired, dominantly white dogs, and as the lions are yellow and red-brown colored, he involved other breeds as well to the breeding program. The first Leon Berger, who had kind of a same outlook as of the today's known ones was born in 1846. Since then their popularity is getting higher and higher. The first intent of Mr. Essig was to create the ideal shepherd dog, but it turned out that they have a completely different character set, and they are not ideal for this work. By nowadays they have become real family dogs, and if you do not consider me biased, I would say that one of the best ones. When it turned out that in spite of their large size they are not ideal for being a shepherd dog, they found out at the same time that they are ideal water rescue dogs, as they like to and can swim very well, and they are fond of humans. Few know but the Leon Burgers have webs between their fingers, similarly to Newfoundland dogs. If we are talking about their character, the standard states that a Leon Burger should be gracious, noble, elegant, relaxed and calm with a middle temperament. They should not be sensible for voices and noises. Interestingly, their hunting instincts are not too strong, although are present in some of the dogs. According to our experiences, if we keep them in packs, feet hunting instincts are stronger than if they are kept alone. Because of their large size and very deep sound you would think that they are really good for protection and guard work and even for protecting your property, but it is not the case. In the majority of cases they are not ideal for these purposes, as they are very friendly even with strangers. In my opinion, my dogs would not attack anybody even in the case if I were not at home and a stranger would try to come into our yard. The maximum they would do is to surround the intruder and stand in his way. They are like gentle molossers who know that they are strong but would never bite somebody. If you want to live together with this breed and have them in your family, it is important to know that they are giant-sized breed and as they are much bigger than the average dogs, the costs in connection with them are also much higher, let's think of high-quality feeding and veterinary bills, for example. This is why I have to say that, before you choose this breed, you have to think over whether you have the financial resources you'll have a dog like this, this is an important part of a responsible decision. Another factor that has utmost importance is whether you have enough time for them, as this breed require intensive daily contacts with their owners, this is how their character develop the best way. According to their preference, they would spend the whole day, seven days a week together with their human friends. The Leon Burger is not a dominant breed, and they accept almost all types of dogs and other animals. As Leon Burgers are eager to please their masters and are a very obedient breed, it is ideal to go to dog school for them, they are eager to learn almost everything. Their learning and memorial abilities are excellent, although there are some Leon Burgers who can be stubborn sometimes. Our dogs for example love to go to dog school, as we are there together, and there are a lot of new and interesting things, like other dogs, with whom they are absolutely neutral. As I mentioned earlier, they like to do everything with and in water, if you plan any water work with your dog, the Leon Burger can be an ideal choice. We usually go for long walks and hikes with our dogs, and they love it very much, of course except in very hot summers which is not ideal for them. If you live a life, when you have to leave your home for long periods or days, then, in my opinion, the Leon Burger is not the ideal dog for you. In connection with their health, they can said to be a healthy breed. 
Dysplasia is quite rare among them if you buy a puppy from good breeders, thanks to the work of the international breeding community. Unfortunately, similarly to other giant-sized breeds, their lifespan is short, usually it is between 6 to 10 years. Sometimes we hear about cases when a Leon Burger lived shorter than 6 years, but I do not think that this is general. On the contrary, we had some dogs who lived 13 years, which is also a rare case. The different forms of cancer illnesses can occur among them, the most frequent is the bone cancer, which is known among the Leon Burgers. As there are no health screens for these illnesses, we cannot do much against it, except that we try to breed the dogs with the best genetic pool and feed them with the highest quality food that is possible. If you want to buy a Leon Burger puppy, you have to spend some time with preparation and with choosing the right breeder who have good and healthy dogs with good genetics. It can be useful to contact more than one breeders and get impressions in connection with their work. One final important thing, never be impatient. There are a lot of applicants and a few good breeders. To get a good, nice and healthy Leon burger takes time and do not want to save the time and bring a too fast decision that you regret later on.